You ever take, you ever been like driving along the street and you see garbage cans on the side of the street and you just want to fucking take them out? Yeah. Yeah. That, and then, that happens. Yeah, I do that with people sometimes. I, but I do it. I actually do it all you the time. Too? Yeah, I drive around that. Some podcasts are slow and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to 10 Minute Podcast. Hey. Welcome to the 10 Minute Podcast. My name is Will Sasso. I'm Chris D'Elia. I'm Brian the Kid Callan. Sometimes I drive around late at night and I just take out garbage cans and things that aren't quite nailed down why that do I know that? will why, damage why my truck. Think, why do you think you do that? I drive around. I go to like Taco, uh, like a Del Taco. There's something you, you really have, wrong with And you. I buy like $30 worth of food, which a Del Taco will get you about 50 pounds worth of food. You are, And then I just drive around taking out fucking signs really and garbage wrong with cans. You. But it sounds like you're a great example for your future children. Now, let me ask you this. Um, you have a couple guilty pleasures, am I right? Yeah, sure. Besides One. cuddling up, like with a good book uh, and a cat under a windowsill, what guilty other things charged, you like to yeah. do? What other Not things? That you, because you don't read, but you just cuddle up with a book. I do. What, no, what I do, do read. Do? I'm reading a great book right now. What do you but read? We've already, uh, it's actually a memoir of uh, someone who wrote uh, a memoir of the daughter of, of Curly Howard. Huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. All right. It's pretty cool. What? Uh, what? Uh, do you have any guilty pleasures? Mm-hmm. What are they? I've been watching wrestling since I was a kid. I was going to say, I know you're a huge WWE fan. Yeah. Who is, who is your favorite wrestler? Um, let's see. Right now, I really like uh, what they're doing with Brodus Clay. I think it's a great direction for that, uh, wee, wee, that gimmick. Wee, wee. What's wrong? Hey, I'm sorry, dude. No, I, I have this app on my phone that <laughs> whenever alarm. somebody talks about something too dorky, it goes off. It's true. No, it's <laughs> no. an app. Okay, but you know, okay, well, he has me... a right to like. F- no, no, no. WWE. I know. That's okay that he likes it, but let me turn the app off. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay, that's condescending. Okay. Dude. What I you... turned it off. And I also think that you know CM Punk is probably a modern day Roddy Piper. Oh, it's going off. I thought I turned it off here. I just hit it. I hit it again. No, I It's hard to have a conversation if you're going to do, if you're going to be condescending. You're right. What are your guilty pleasures? I I actually don't have any. I you uh, have none. No, I'm a very everything I do like is very legit. It feeds my soul and it's very Uh, fucking. You're so condescending. It's so obnoxious. I'm trying to have a conversation. I know. No, me too. I know, and I wish I could be a part of it, but I really can't. Okay, you so guys, you don't have any guilty pleasures. I've, I've never masturbated I, once. Oh what? my god! What? I've never masturbated. I don't either, but you've, that's because I compete in kung fu, like in in uh, oh, underground so you, tournaments. You're but, sort of like Manny Pacquiao, how he says he doesn't have sex. Well, like you months can't. Before you can't. You guys have never been in a fight. You don't know anything about combat well, sports. No, but you, you know, my football coach in high school yeah. said, "Guys, no sex during football season." It's true, and that was fine with me because I didn't lose my virginity until I was around twenty. I was fucking. I was fucking. Oh no! What happened? What I'm sorry, I think it was the 21 <laughs> remark that how you said you didn't well, lose Well, it might have been 20 or 19, but... Bree, I, bree, okay, bree, Chris, can you bree, shut the app bree, off, please? Bree, please shut the app, shut the app off. off. Are now, you guys sorry. excited about WrestleMania? Bree, 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 <laughs> bree, 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 Hulk Hogan and Macho Man right. and all those guys. And <laughs> I got it. I hit it. Did you got it? Brian. Chris. <laughs> Brian. Brian, you Brian. just... Brian. For those of you who can't witness what just happened, Brian just literally stood up and farted into the mic. And I if you rewind one. it, I you can one. hear it. I got one. I think I got one. Hey, rewind it. You can hear it. I think I got one. Hold on. It didn't. What was that? It a silent happen. one? Nothing happened. You guys, oh, I don't... Jesus. I, I want to go on record. I'm not doing this. <laughs> I would this never is the do this. Dumbest podcast you guys, ever. you guys are so I've said fucking that I juvenile. Like wrestling seven bree, times. Bree. I got it. You and then, guys, and then Brian <laughs> farted. It's so dumb. I know. So I, dumb. I'm the youngest hey guys, here. Hey guys, how does it feel to have the dumbest podcast in the world? <laughs> it's the greatest. Terrible. I don't even want. I, I, I want to quit I, right now. I literally now. want to fart again, but I can't. <sighs> hey, um, is there an app for farting? No. Yeah, there actually probably. I'm sure there's a I'm fart sure app. There is. Are you? How often are you not on your phone? Me? Yeah. I, I don't I don't have a That's cell your phone. guilty pleasure. Texting is your guilty pleasure. Maybe that you're is right. your yeah. guilty pleasure. Yeah. I guess I suppose My, I, mine is, is mine reading reading classic novels and discussing foreign policy and practicing kung fu. What do you Will. Will? Will <laughs> Will. That was such a small fart from that, a huge man. Will. That's I'm sorry, so gross. Everybody. I'm really sorry, everybody. You know what's crazy? You're not we're, sorry. We're full grown adults. That's the second time you How did are it. you sorry? You got up, you, you pushed your ass. For the against. second time, it was the second time I'm you did it. I'm just trying to impress my friends. You did it well, first. Well, I'm your friend and I'm not impressed. <laughs> oh, wait, here comes Brian. Come on, Brian, stop. <laughs> you 
You can't even... You can't even do it. You're gonna get a hernia. <laughs> almost. I, oh yeah. Hey doc, I, I got a hernia. Oh, how'd you get a hernia? Oh, well, I have this podcast. Come on, Will. Oh, Will. God damn. I, you know what? You're gonna you're gonna shit on the microphone. <laughs> it sounds like you're underwater. What is going on? Your farts are going blue. This is so. Blue. You guys, I, stop like doing you, this. Did you stick a coffee like percolator up your ass? No. Come on, Will. Shh, stop. Shh, shh. That, that one was super quiet. Okay. I actually heard it. Please stop. Right, let's okay. Stop. Let's stop. Let's, let's, stop let's talk about something important. I said let's talk about stuff and then you guys had to start farting. <laughs> I didn't... Well, me? I didn't you fart. To, it was I you, didn't Brian. fart at all. all right. I did not maybe I fart. Did, maybe I started. But um, uh, so so do, would you ever... Did you, you're a big guy. Did you ever think about being a professional wrestler? I did think about becoming a professional wrestler. And what would your name be? What would you, hold on. I got it. What would your name be if you were a pro wrestler? Probably Softcore Sasso. Please, please, please. I got Soft, that one. Softcore Sasso? Yeah. What would Chris's name be? Um, uh, Chris's, the Trunk. Uh, Greyhound? <laughs> no, mine would be The Trunk. Why would it be called The Trunk? Because you can't move me. Like a tree Chris trunk. Would be, Chris would um, be the... You're not that big, though. Stonewall. I don't know. Stonewall. He'd be the White Flamingo. No, yeah, I you'd be the white flamingo because you have no. you have flamingo legs. You have no. androgynous legs. Mine wouldn't be and, the white uh, flamingo. It would be trunk, or it would be stonewall. <laughs> In, explain, stonewall. Explain yeah. trunk. Yeah. And how come your app isn't going off? We're all talking about wrestling now. Uh, apparently, what I'm saying is not dorky. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't make the app. <laughs> oh my god! I didn't make the app. Yeah, it's unbelievable how how how. Uh, oh, I wish. This you thank are. you very much. I, I didn't compliment you. You said I'm unbelievable. No, I said it's unbelievable how condescending you are. <laughs> no, I wish more than anything. That what would right, my name be? Uh, uh, like like muscular. I think your muscular. name. It would be well. It would obviously be, be Flying Brian. Yeah, like because like, like, I can jump through the air, fly, and, fly and kick and stuff. Brian Blair. No, like you float. You, you, would you take, float when you walk. You would take that name. You would be Flying Brian Callen. Yeah, because you float when you walk. What is that good? Like yeah, you flitter. You're, fun, you're fun. That's you're a fun person. I, um, fairy does. I wish for nothing more right now that I could work up a fucking a, a good fart. Well, that's yeah, well, a bad wish. Yeah, that is a that. bad. We're on to, what is he doing? No. no, please no. No. Oh. oh. Oh God. my Will. God! I'm really Will. sorry. What everybody. kind of fart are those? <laughs> I don't know. But it sounds like you're underwater, people, dude. Seventeen people are going to hear this, and it's <laughs> disgusting. Know. I'm really. It's Brian, such a weird let fart. The, let the record show that Brian, you started it. All right. Well, then see. Once you get you started, I, 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 I want to go on record. <laughs> Seriously, I don't think this is funny. <laughs> I don't think it's fun. It actually is funny. I, but I do wish I wasn't a part of it. Well, you are a part of it. And we're talking about WWE wrestling and farts. And that's what this podcast has been about. So we have minutes, yeah. maybe even a minute, to bring this back up to, okay, let's to do something let's do lofty and important let's and do intellectual. It. What's your favorite movie of all time, Chris? My favorite movie yeah, of, of all time. All time. Uh, that's a very easy you question. You have five seconds. Five, four. Three. Blue Street two, with Martin Lawrence. <laughs> Will, what's your favorite Luke, Luke movie Wilson of all is time? It. My favorite movie of all time Five. is Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. But, good call. It's but, a good one. But it's Chris, why did you say that this, this, you know, this, you wish you weren't a part of this podcast and all that stuff? And then, hold on, Brian's going. No, I don't. No, you don't. Okay. No, you don't. <laughs> You're just going to shit your you, pants. You, 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 start, you started out saying, hey, you know, Will's farting and talking about wrestling. And then you give us Blue Streak by... Yeah, that movie is a. Okay, well, you're joking. You didn't see that movie, obviously. It's a really good mo movie. What is your favorite movie of all time? Blue Streak with Martin Lawrence and Luke Wilson. Oh, Thank you very God. much. What an idiot. Well, please, not again. No. no. Oh, great. That, I said we had, we have, now we have like 10 seconds to get this thing. It's not going to happen. Thanks for listening to the 10 minute podcast. And, we have a uh, minute left. Thanks for. Uh, we, we have a whole minute? Subscribing the, on the iTunes. The music starts a minute. Uh, yeah, it's the like music a minute. always oh, starts okay. a minute up. So Will's jumping the gun on the fucking. What, what, what would you do to this music? Run, run through a, a field of poppies? Yeah, and I'd fall flat on my face and fart a rainbow to heaven. You would? <laughs> I'm sorry. It was a rainbow thing. I think hey, that jumped in. Uh, thanks for listening. On uh, you know, you can listen to us on iTunes and subscribe if you haven't already. Just and, Google Brian Callen and you'll find everything. In your, uh, what, that, uh, I think it's a uh, Google Brian Callen. It comes up. Fucking, yeah, it comes. It triggered it. My Stitcher name is not radio. Radio. Say it again. Nerdy. Say your name. Brian Callen. Uh, that's it. You're doing that with no, your mouth. No, I'm not. I'm Stitcher not. Stitcher Smart Radio and uh, check us out on Twitter at at Ten Min Pod. It's your favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that set off? The alarm? I can't turn it off. <laughs> oh, shit. Turn it off! It's bad advertising for us. <laughs> Please it's turn bad it off. advertising. Chris. Yeah. If I punched you in the face.
Uh, You'd shit your pants. <laughs> you know, you would. No, I wouldn't. Do You've it. never been punched properly no, by somebody I wouldn't. who can punch and I can punch. Some podcasts are slow and you don't know how long they last. That's why you listen to 10 Minute Podcast. Welcome to the 10 Minute Podcast. I'm Ryan Kellen and uh, this is brought to you by uh, Amazon.com. Oh, Click oh, on the link. Well, okay, get through, but let me make do a more. lot of money. All right. Shut up. And uh, Gamefly, uh, no, my, oh, if okay. you click on those links, we get like millions of dollars. So please do it. And um, all right, and I'm Chris D'Elia. So and this is Chris D'Elia. You, you did that really badly. And yeah. uh, so do Gamefly and click through. And well, do the... I'm sorry, I'm excited and I'm a little nervous. What are you? Ex- we have an amazing uh, well, f- guest. Well, first of all, why don't we say that fucking our uh, Will Sasso is not with us, right? I Will mean, Sasso's to... not with us. Will Sasso is uh, in Canada. I think um, f- pulling his putt or something r- ridiculous. Is that what he went to do? go do? Pulling yeah, he goes putt? to Canada to find a dark corner and pull his mm. fucking putt. Um, but we have, for my money, Is one kind of the of more exciting. colorful yeah. and more exciting uh, um, profiles in the last 50 years, yeah. at least. And certainly, certainly a man who stands at the top of the American boxing pantheon thank you iron mike tyson thank you for having me it's unbelievable it's some wonderful wonderful to have me here wonderful to have you here yeah, yeah. One, i'm thank you so much for brian i know that i met you before because you did the hangover movies that i'm in and yep. i'm just yeah. I'm, this is a wonderful wonderful uh occasion to be here with you guys you and chris Aaliyah. Uh, well, Delia, yeah, Delia, Chris, Chris Delia. Yeah. Delia, it's what, Delia. What's, uh, Mike, yeah. Mike, you know, you've had a really great second chapter. Thank and I you. know a lot. Yeah. I know you were, and I know a lot of other people's were. What, what happens to Mike after boxing? Yeah, I'm not that person no more. You know, I'm, I'm not well, you, that person. You don't anymore. box anymore, is what I you're saying? I don't box anymore. Yeah. I'm no, retired after I know that. I fought, you fought that white you're, guy. You're now an entertainer of a different kind. You're actually an actor. You have a one man show. Yeah, I have in, a one man show, you which know. is so exciting. Yeah. And you're doing it here. You're making money. as You know, I mean, it's funny because when you said, you know, like. Like you talk about how at the beginning of the show you said, Chris, if I punch you in your face, you shit. You know, and it's like that makes me laugh because I know you're doing comedy. I love your podcast, but like actually it also brings up to a serious topic at the particular time in my life when I was fighting. Right. You know, and it's the fighter's mentality, you know. So when if I was to come at you like you, Brian Callen, just as an example, you wouldn't know what to do with me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, if I'm in that frame of mind, you wouldn't know what to do with me. We're not even the right. same species. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. You would come in the ring. I would say, why would they put this plate of food in front of me? Right. Yeah. You know? yeah, yeah. So, no, I would I, punch. I would try to punch through, not in a brutal way, but like I would try. I would think about punching you start on one side of your face to make it explode out the back of your head. Okay. Well, yeah. no, no, that's, no, no, but I'm not that person pretty brutal, anymore. right? But you would so so you don't do that no, kind of you, stuff you anymore. You were the hardest hitting. You. Yeah. They always say you and Ernie Shavers were the hardest hitting yeah. fighters in, in, of all time. I, w- I would rely on speed. You know, Customata and my mentor, and my great teacher, my yeah. guardian, Customata taught me about speed. You know what I'm saying? So like, yeah, you were speed, very fast. Speed kills. Yeah. Yeah, and when it got a hold of me, you know, Cus broke me down and built me back up again, you know, the way he won, you know what I'm saying? So, like, when he says bite, I'll bite. When he said, like, attack, I'd attack. So, if you came in the ring, I'd say, why did they bring this half bitch in the ring to fight the great Mike Tyson? Yeah, yeah. I would, you were just as good as dead. But I'm not that person anymore. Right. I'm a peaceful person. Now. Right. So, you, okay, and how long have you been a peaceful person? I'm sorry, I have a deviated septum. That's why my nose, you That's can't. That's fine. Hear. So, so how long have you been? If, you, if Chris Aaliyah, if Chris Aaliyah, if you got Delia, yeah, Chris Aaliyah, if you, Delia, yeah. it's funny, it's funny. No, I'm sorry. What? Yeah, Chris, Chris Delia. Delia. His name Delia. is Chris Aaliyah. No, Chris Delia. Like the singer, the yeah, R&B no, singer. Yeah, it's not. Just, just it, yes, he's in the show. Chris Delia. Okay. What's okay. your last no, name? No, no, I'm not Yeah, it's uh, Delia. What's your last? Yeah, it's Delia. Delia. Chris, your name is Chris Delia. Delia. You yeah, should you, just. No, you just say. Why don't you just first name should just be Chris? Yeah. No, that. If I you came in the you. ring and meet Chris Lee, I would look at you. I would be like, who is this? Why are you? I would be so enraged just looking at your hair. I would be like, why the fuck they put this man with fucking long girl hair in here? I would punch you. So I agree f- with you. I would punch you so fucking hard right. just because of the hair alone would he throw me. It would throw me into a rage. Yeah, so okay, saying, now, Chris. okay, hold on. That's Don't, funny. But I'm not that person anymore. No, I understand. You know? The way you talk about it and the way you're, you're, you're describing it makes it sound like you're kind of like enjo- getting joy out of it. I'm sorry, I have a DBA exception because when you're a fighter, you know what I'm saying? You got a wide face, can absorb a lot of punishment, I, I, but listen, it's, I, not, it's different. Now. How, I do, I don't how many know times do you think you've been punched in the face? But ho- 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 a lot of times, but hold on. You, 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 um, you, 
you say you're not that person anymore. I'm not that person no right. more. I, I don't have the heart for that no more. I don't love that no more. I you understand. Know what I'm, saying? I'm I love my birds. I love pigeons. I understand. I love my family. And that's very sweet. And I understand. Yeah. But the way you talk and describe about what you would do to me and Brian if we walked in the but ring. You don't even understand. We're not even the same species. You no, don't no, even no. understand I, what I, you do with a man like me. You know what I'm saying? Like if I got in the ring with you, it would be be a situation where it's life or death. You know what I'm saying? Most people don't even understand the situation between life, yeah. life or death. You know, like like the way a fighter thinks. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's what. Yeah, no, I know it's a difference. I know that, but uh, so, but uh, you're you're. What, what I want I want to read you a poem. Okay. okay. So and this is a sweet poem. I want to read you a poem. This is a poem by my favorite poet Oscar Wilde. It's called "The Battle of Reading Gale," and this I want to read to you. In Reading Gale, by Reading Town, there is a pit of shame, and in it lies a wretched man eaten by teeth of flame. Okay. Um, in a burning, winding yeah. sheet, he lies, and his grave has okay. got no name. No, don't and him. there, till Christ called forth yeah. the dead in silence, let him lie. No need to waste the fool. Okay. The, Mike, wait, hold on, a the foolish Mike, tear. Yeah, or that's heave cool. The right. windy so, yeah, so that's good. It's my favorite poem. Yeah. Okay. The man had killed. Okay. Let me let me finish. So okay. I might just break your jaw right See, off. See, now your, that's the thing I'm, okay. I'm talking about. It sounds like you're not the guy. You're not that guy anymore. Is I'm what you're saying. I'm not that guy. I'm a peaceful so, person. I'm wait, just so trying to read poetry. Him? You're threatening him. No, I'm saying if Brian Callen came in and like, don't let me finish my poem. You know, that's the kind of. If I was faced with that skull duggery in the street, you know, I mean, I might just have to break you down. Yeah, this is not the street though. I'm good. Can I ask you a question though? If Brian was going to interrupt you doing the poem and, and and thwart you doing your poem, would you beat him up? I'm sorry, my nose is messed up. And I know you have a wide, <laughs> wide nose. Yeah, my, boxers, I got, well, I got, boxers I got, have wide noses. Yeah, yeah. Now I got DV septum. What was right. your question, Chris Aaliyah? See, this is what I'm talking but, about. You know what I'm saying? Because what? like now, now at this point, I'm a different person. You know, I'm right. not, I'm not like that no more. Yeah, but, but when you I was a kid, like, up. and Customata brought me in, I didn't trust mm -hmm. nobody. I was a thug from the streets. You know, we would go to the drug dealers, we yeah. go right to their fucking houses, knock on the door. Sure. They open the door and they just see one person, and then we all come in. It's a horde mentality. Mm -hmm. It's like my birds. You know what I'm saying? Like I got mm -hmm. pigeons, I got birds, and these sometimes these birds live together for 10, 10 years, sometimes for fifteen years. You know, these birds mm -hmm. love each. Other. They live like a family, but if you throw that food down for them, then they all, then they all, um, all like go at each other, like they're fighting each other. You know that's the mentality. I always cared for Lennox. Right. I always and cared for Evander. I didn't give a shit about Trevor Burbick, that piece of shit, you okay, know, because he beat Muhammad Ali down. Okay, but I'm gonna I... finish my poem, or I'm gonna okay, smash then... both your faces. Hey, 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 hold on. Whoa, whoa. Let, let me just. I just have a quick question. Yeah. What do you? Obviously, you have a great deal of aggression still. What are you doing with it now? I mean, are you? Yeah. What how do you? It's, it's the rest of this here, the Oscar Wilde poem. I, I know, but we, we don't have a lot of time to read it. By all that this be heard. Okay, we Some get do it. it with I a know Oscar look. Wilde. Yeah. Some do it with a flattering word. Yeah. Sure. The coward does right. it with a kiss. The brave man with a sword. Mm -hmm. So you know what I'm saying? There's different yeah. words to sure. express emotions. You sure. Know yeah. Saying? No, that's that's definitely I, obvious, I, I, but. Yeah. How do you deal with anger? Yeah, what are you doing to deal with your... Because you're I'm obviously... Not, I'm not an angry person. But you're a very no passionate more. person, you know? I'm a very so. peaceful person okay. now, you know what I'm saying? But like, like Chris Alia, Brian Callen, if you Dalia, came in yeah. the ring with me, I would get so enraged immediately. No, I know. Yeah, I would probably gonna... just want to punch your face until it turns into foam, oh. pink foam Okay, but we're not fighters. And but we not, not, we would you're, never... not, you're not even the same league as me. It's like, I, I don't even understand. You yeah. guys go up on stage and tell knock-knock jokes no, to people? No, it's not. That's like, not when you go up on stage and tell jokes to a bunch of drunk girls... Hey, Mike. And... Hey, Mike, per he guys? fuck face. Hey, what are you shut calling up. me? I'm not that nah, afraid of you, bro. I'm a, don't, don't fucking... I'm a, I'm a peaceful shut person, up. but hey, I will drag... Hey, I'll punch you against stupid. your car. Hey, what stupid do you do, face. What do you do for a living? Stupid face. You say other words to people. Do not fucking insult me, because okay. I'm not afraid of you. All right. Well, I Because I fucking do jujitsu. All right, but can I just say one thing? What? Oh, oh. I'm sorry I had to do oh. that. I'm oh my sorry God! I had to my, do that. His He's face. Bleeding. He's bleeding. What happened to his face? Not because I'll explain it to you. This Holy fuck, he, dude! Because his face he, doesn't even look like his face oh, anymore. No, it's because he. It hey, looks like a. a it looks like a bloody tarantula. Yeah, because he said. Because it's all fun and games to like have you know fun pretend and stuff, but like you know I just want to let him know there's a difference. Between oh my God, me and Brian. Him. Uh, we gotta, we gotta get him to. A, I'm, I'm gonna read my poem. I'm again. stepping all over his teeth, Brian. Make sure. Oh, you sound like me. You got a deviated septum. Brian, Brian, come here. Oh my God, Mike Tyson, please don't ever move, Mike. Oh, move so I can grab him. He's it. making poo. Hey, Brian. Hey, what do you think of this? 
Oh, God. Yeah, he's making poo everywhere. There's poo coming out of his mouth. Brian, are you okay? Yeah, all, all glory to God. Shh. No, no, no. There's no reason to shh. shh. Be quiet. Why? We're doing a podcast. That's the worst thing ever to do. Be very, very quiet right now. The worst thing to no, do. No, just whisper. No, you gotta talk. Shh. Pretend we're in a fort in the living room. Shh. Some podcasts are slow. And you don't know how long they last. That's why you listen to 10 Minute Podcast. All right. Welcome yeah. to the 10 Minute Podcast brought to you by Amazon. Yeah. If you want to buy something on Amazon, go to our website, 10 minutepodcastcom Hit the banner. Hit the Amazon banner. We'll get a kickback. That's yeah. also brought to you by GameFly. It also doesn't matter if you do this because nobody ever does it. Yeah, but people do it. And that's no, when we no. get a little kickback. So We're whispering. Or you do Gamefly. Just click on the shit through Gamefly and get free games or whatever. But who fucking cares? <laughs> My name is Will Sasso. Hey, what's up? I'm Crystal here. There's no Brian Callen today. <laughs> <laughs> so, um... We just basically, we know a lot of you guys listen uh, to this podcast in your car. So what we want you to do is, <laughs> what we want you to do this time is, uh, we're gonna whisper the whole time. We're gonna whisper, yeah. We're gonna whisper. So, right, so right. we want you to turn up your car real fucking loud, and we want you to lean forward closer to the stereo <laughs> while you're driving. So you look like a fucking asshole when you're yeah. driving. And also, if you're like listening to it on the subway or the bus, or you're at school or right. you're at work, and you got a headset in, just like make a real squinty face like you're trying to hear what someone's saying. Right, exactly. And also. <laughs> Yeah. Also, the next, if, if we're ever on like a shuffle or something like this, <laughs> after the, after we're on and another song comes on, you'll have turned it up so fucking loud and the next song will blare your fucking eardrums off. Yeah. So that's basically what we're trying to do is fuck with you. But listen right. though, so your Will didn't know the Whisper song by uh, the Ying Yang Twins. Yeah, I didn't know that there's a song like Because that. he's just a, a white guy. No, 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 no. I, I love hip hop, but the know. Ying Yang Ting's, his Twins, they suck. It's, yeah, well, mm. Not ying yang tings. <laughs> Are you, did you just whisper them? Yeah. It's it's ying yang twins actually. They they have the best episode of MTV Cribs ever. They do. Yeah, because they treated it like they were shooting a music video, but it doesn't cut together like a music video. You fucking idiots. So they were like they were like jumping in front of each other and stuff, and it was basically like, hey, look at these two stupid idiots with fucking money. But actually, they don't have much money because they were in a shitty house in the burbs in Florida. Yeah, they don't. They suck. I like the cribs that where they don't have that much money, and that's obvious. Oh, yeah. It's like, but they still try to make it look good. Red Man had, yeah. had a good one. In his apartment. He had, he had like a townhouse in Jersey. And his friend was like sleeping on a cot. Yeah, and he's straight up like, yo, I bought this shit with one album, and now I don't right. give a fuck anymore. Right, 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 right. So here's the deal, though. Well, because he's a middle-aged white guy. No, I'm 37. Okay, well, but so he doesn't know what the Ying Yang Twins are or that song. Actually, so, that is middle-aged, isn't it? I mean, for you, probably, because you'll die when you're 50 or something. <laughs> but so, anyway, you'll die by the time it is Brian's age right now. Brian. Which is, Brian is not here. He's shooting a movie with Ice Cube and John Leguizamo, yeah. which you'll be able to get strictly on Redbox pretty soon. <laughs> <laughs> it's the first, first ever straight-to-Redbox <laughs> movie. But also Lawrence Fishburne and Kevin Hart are in it. Right. Oh, so that's that actually... It's not going to be Redbox because those guys yeah. are the shit. Yeah. Um, so anyway, he didn't know this song. And if you guys don't know this song and you're middle-aged white guys as well or like an old Vietnamese guy from Vietnam, you would basically... Because <laughs> those are the only people who don't know what a song is like. That. Or, or if you're a baby, perhaps, and haven't heard the song. I don't really want to whisper this argument, but I can make a subtle argument that anybody who knows a fucking Yang Yang Twin song by name is a fucking moron. No, that's not true. Oh, yes, it is. No, absolutely not because they're cultured. No, so they're not. So here's... The... <laughs> no, they're not. So... <laughs> <laughs> so, you know what this reminds me of? What? This reminds me of when, like, you're. Th I had an argument once with my <laughs> girlfriend, my ex girlfriend. I was in high school and we had a. Pro we went to like prom together, and we all had like a sleepover at my friend's house, and we got in such a fucking argument because she wanted to argue, but it was way too fuck. I mean, she. Yeah. I'm sorry, she wanted to cuddle, but it was way too fucking hot. So <laughs> I was like, "Listen, you just don't fucking just just we're in the same bed. Can you just fucking sit a little bit away from me because I can't fucking breathe. There's 14." <laughs> This fucking room, and and it was so funny. But anyway, so um, so basically, well, that's another song. This song goes like this: um, Wait to see my dick. Wait to see my dick. Oh girl, wait to see my dick. I'ma beat this pussy up like bam, 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 beat the pussy up, beat the pussy up, beat the pussy up. Song. It's called the Whisper Song, you fucking asshole. <laughs> he literally whispered.
bumpers the whole time. The whole time. Okay, that is pretty cool. Yes. He, yeah. And it was a fucking huge hit. White girls were like, oh my God, you know. But the song's called, <laughs> the song's called, the song's called, Wait, in parentheses, the Whisper song. And I don't know why it's called Wait. Oh, I know why. Because like I said, <laughs> they're fucking terrible. <laughs> Yo, by the way, to be totally honest, I'm completely lightheaded right now because we're whispering. Me too. I'm not getting enough oxygen. <laughs> okay. Do you um, want to stop whispering? Absolutely not. Okay. You got to go for it, dude. We're going to go for it the whole fucking and time. Think about how annoyed our listeners are at this point. We, 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 ooh, what was that noise? That was a pop because we're popping our peas because we're whispering. Yeah, because we're whispering, so we got to be careful. If Brian was here, no one would be listening to this podcast by now. Also, he'd be fucking absolutely not whispering. <laughs> Well, we love our listeners, so maybe, I don't know, maybe you guys will dig this. It's a novelty episode, I think. I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely a novelty. Novel, novelty. Mm. <laughs> Did I say novelty? <laughs> you, said, you said novelty. Mm. Is, that, is, it, is that a drink you drink? Mm. Yeah, it's Ovaltine, but with knobs. Mm. That doesn't sound refreshing. <laughs> um. So, so yeah, so basically. This is a fun, this is a good way to, I'd love to. I'd love to only communicate with someone in my life this way. This is this would be good, but that's but you would basically have severe problems. But here's the deal. Will, before we start any podcast, before we ever start any podcast, yeah. we sit down and Will's always like, what are the topics we're going to talk about? What are we going to do? Yeah. And I always say, let's just fucking do shows right now. Press record. Right. And then, because sometimes we come out with some good shit. Right. Right. And then he this says, one of those times. No, you're wrong. Because this is the Whisper Podcast. And that's fucking cool. But what you gotta do is chill the fuck out and let us just be fucking creative because we're geniuses. Okay, okay. dude, calm the down. The three of us are fucking geniuses. You almost spoke there. You're getting a little bit out of control. No, it's no, important to have humility in life. Now, I... Th no. <laughs> Don't. By the way, whispering, it's important to have humility in life. It's, that's absolutely never been whispered ever. Yes, it has been. You've never spent time in an ashram in Cambodia. Come on, Will. You farted in your No, mouth. I didn't. You didn't? No, I swear to God, I didn't. Okay. This is like this is like a podcast coming to you from like a fort in the yeah. living room because we don't want our parents to wake us up. Or a real fort or, or in no. war. Or a real fort, yeah. Because like, we don't want to get shot. We don't want to get shot by the Germans. Right. Well, look. Uh, Which also Germans don't know the Whisper song either. Basically middle-aged white guys, Germans, and <laughs> Vietnam, old guys from Vietnam. All Germans are middle-aged white guys, Chris. <laughs> Germans come out, a German baby comes out, and he's like, hi, ah, where's everybody? Wow. Yeah. Man, that, that bit would be yeah. way funnier if we weren't whispering. I know, but now we have to whisper. Now you're right. But imagine us saying that in our regular voices. Yo, how are you? Yeah. That's good too. Hello, I'm so wet. What is this? What did, did I come out with? Luggage? Yeah. Or is this a placenta? What are you calling that? <laughs> this is like I came with a carry-on. I think... <laughs> I think that... Well, you know, you and you and Brian are among the funniest people. Thank you. You're welcome. But I don't think that it, it, having a topic would hurt you fucking assholes. No, you're right. It wouldn't hurt. But here's the deal. That's why we got to start out fresh and just bam, 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 as Brian bam, says. Bam, bam.
first I roll, like I'm rolling right now. Right. When you roll, we're, what we're, the fuck does that mean? That we're recording. Yeah. yeah. We, we have a little funny banter. Yeah. yeah then, I, I'm, not, I'm not doing it in the term. Then the, the music comes it's in like this. It's a business term. Oh, Jesus. Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to 10 Minute Podcast. This fucking guy kissing his shoulder. He's Somebody's, literally moving that's it. That's right. I was He's going, moving to it. And Chris to the was song. dancing to the... And kissing his yeah, shoulder. Yeah, he's dancing the song. His, and look at his hands. His, his fingers are his out fingers like that. His fingers are out like he's a, he's like so a happy. Out a teacup. dancer. It's called I'm, guy's... I'm emptying out a teacup. Yeah, no, it's called the right. empty. The, his so hand happy. is upside down. Welcome to the 10-Minute Podcast brought to you by Amazon. <laughs> you want to buy something on Amazon, hit 10minutepodcast.com. Hit the Amazon link. We're also brought to you by Gamefly. Gamefly! Okay. All right. And All right. Talab. Talab. And uh, we were recently Talab. voted one of the best new comedy podcasts by iTunes. Thank you very much, iTunes, and thank you all for listening. My name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian the Kid Kellen. And I'm Chris D'Elia. And why am I so happy, Brian? Okay, well, all right. Chris just did Conan, he yeah. just, and apparently he did well. He yeah. paneled on Conan. It's always exciting. He's on when, the couch. It, when you're he's on the actor, couch. Right. And it just went... <laughs> doing, is that a machine gun? Yeah, it, a was. Machine gun it was. Okay, you're machine gunning the audience? Yeah. Oof, 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 oof. What is that that's, now? That's the chopper I left in after Dude. I began. Yeah. All right, man. Come yeah, on. You, please don't so, be this cocky. It's so annoying. Uh, I think I'm under I'm underdoing it. I yeah. think I'm underdoing uh, it. You no. didn't see it yet, but yeah. I think. Yeah. Uh, well, it's not it's not history making. No, it, I know it's, it's not. It's, it's it's you did how long were you on there for? Ten minutes? Maybe? I was eight minutes. Oh, eight minutes. But it was it That's was a, a good s- segment. A very very strong Commercial. tight eight minutes. It was a tight okay, eight minutes. Stop. You're snarling. It don't. was. Look yeah. at how he's it was doing. Real that. tight. He's what very is, excited. Look, he's he kissing just, his fucking shoulder. He just came. I did it. He just came from the show. That's right. I just you know? came from it. Yeah. He just. We're, he's we're, not even we're, looking at us. They were worried. They were worried. They were worried. As, as I went out there. Bam, 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 bam. Bro. Bam, another bam. reason he's, he's, he's don't he's, apologize for him. He's making I'm just sound saying effects. Why he's excited? But bullshit. He's making sound effects. As we're recording this, Chris had not only just did Conan O'Brien. Just he, did it. He, right. Then he went home, and by the time he got home, it was on TV, so That's then he right. watched it. Pa, 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 so pa, just to pa, see pa, how he God, did. As performers, you want to see how you did. And how did you... How did, well, I how came did you, off like an extension of myself, which is how you want to come off on one of these things as a comedian. Okay. You do stand-up. I did stand-up on Fallon. Look, I've done it. I've done stand-up on oh, Fallon. Geez. Okay. This guy, this guy is fuck. It's I'm going to punch kinda... him right in the face. And what you hope for when you get on the couch, and I do stand-up every night, so when you do stand-up every yeah. night, you know what it is. When you get out there on the couch and you're talking to somebody that yeah. does this for a living, Conan right. O'Brien, you hope for the best. Yeah. And I went out and I... Hey, hey, can What is that now? That's just laying down train tracks so the fucking train can go by. Can you stop Ooh, using? Dude, you gotta stop doing. Can you stop fucking doing fucking effects, metaphors? That's right. And, and as the train's effects? going by, I'm talking to us like a human being. I'm sitting there just. Ping, ping, what are you doing? Are you shooting at the plane? I'm shooting if, uh, in the windows, hitting the guys in the head. Uh, ping, ping. Okay. That's what I was doing. Why and, do you, well, I, look, I, just to just to. I did really well. Just so oh, that, I did really man. well. Just so that you can Be understand more obnoxious. it. Brian, just so you can understand it, like the last time I did one of the, the big talk shows was, was when, I guess the last one was like when Stooges came out, I did Leno, okay. and I understand what Chris is saying, because I went out there on the couch to, you know, yeah. to promote the Three Stooges, and it was kind of one of these. What are you doing? Uh, what is a, this? Hold on. There's okay. another board I think there's more, Brian. I think there's, I think there's more. What? Screwing oh. in the. Yeah, I know what you're doing. I can tell what you're I did screwing was, in. I built a house. Oh, okay. <laughs> listen, I fucked, dude. I built. <laughs> I sat there. I built a house. I could understand. I, I could understand so Chris, that analogy. Chris laid I, down I, I, train I, tracks. I, he laid. Rip, 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 yeah. And then. A, yeah, exactly. And then he's a ping, ping, ping. Yeah. I'm over here going. Hey, Mike, back it up. Okay, guys. Here's the cement being poured. It was I get fucking it. eight minutes and five minutes. You know what I How did you know show? mine was five minutes? I wanna, who gives a fuck if it was seven minutes? I'll give you eight. Okay? No, I understand it what you're saying. It wasn't even ten minutes. You didn't build a fucking house, and you didn't lay down tra- rail tracks. I get it. Stop <laughs> making sound effects. You're both a butt couple of one-two losers. No, right? I, I I totally get what you're saying, Will. Though it does feel yeah. that way. I'm and, really happy for my friend Chris. And he you know what? There, you inspire <laughs> me, man. When oh, I cheers. see you, because I see you do on Leno, and I see you on Leno just. <laughs> Stop. Don't. Stop it. Well, what Stop I, it. I might bring over the Stop it. I saw you do that. He and didn't honestly, do that. He didn't build yeah, a fucking... I, you know, I can't wait to watch the Conan because I know that Chris is going to be over here with the... Yeah. Hey, hey, tell you what. Hey, Bernie. Hey, Bernie. Hey, Dan. Hey, Dan. Yeah. Now, what is that? Exactly? And bring his head over there. And yeah. Go. Why does that right. like That's the foreman. Strong. That's the foreman. That's the foreman. Yeah. yeah. He's yeah, putting exactly. together the train tracks. The train tracks. Exactly. Train, don't, don't drop the train. Right. Okay. Okay. And that's what happens though, Will. Hey, fuck faces. 
When you lay down railroad tracks, it takes years. Not eight minutes, okay? What you did was you got on the stage and you did some, you got up on Conan and you did some laughy laugh stuff, uh, uh, grab ass stuff that's kind of prepared. I guess it went well. That shows on five nights a week, right, okay? Has right, been right. for 20 years. Right. Stop acting like you fucking built the pyramids, you couple one, two fucking losers. Okay. He, he built the train tracks. Yeah, he I, didn't I, build train tracks and I resent the metaphor. He made, you never. You never okay. Were you ever on Conan? I was on Letterman. Okay, but were you ever on Conan? Can you answer me yes I or no? I was on. Okay, so that's no. Letter. Listen, have you ever built a train track? No. Okay, so then I guess I don't know why. Don't use that math. Don't we're do that. We're talking about this don't. with you. Can I just ask? Don't. Maybe a more diplomatic way of figuring out what Brian's getting at is asking him this. Brian, when you were on Letterman, what did you build? Yeah. What did you build? He built a train. He laid down train tracks across country. I built a fucking house. Yeah. Like a sturdy seven, house. Seven a very sturdy house. The house is still there. Yeah. Brian. yeah. All right. The house, Brian, when, the house is worth $4.5 million. Okay. All right. Listen to me. The, my, life, Weatherproof. my life is a tapestry. The sound effect for my life oh. is this. Now, what is that? Sounds is like that? you're painting. Maybe painting. Thank you. When Michelangelo was painting the Sistine Chapel, Jeez. was there any noise... Or was there just this pitter patter, the sound of the occasional, the occasional, the occasional paint drop that would hit him on his cheek? And then the sound of his brush. Went blind, practically, painting the Sistine Chapel. Who did he do it for? Something much bigger than himself. You apathetic, you apathetic couple, one, two. Please pronounce Fucking the a, please pronounce the H. Yeah, when you say apathetic. apathetic. It's a couple ap, apathetic. No. Appetite. We're not we're it, not appetizers. You couple apathetic. It's not appetite. Dogos. It's apathetic. Apathetic. It's just like saying I want to eat some appetizers. I, I'm understated in my life. My appetizers. life is a tapestry. Okay. You guys think about it's a sugar. Your life is a your, tapestry. And your dicks and your bellies. <laughs> I don't That's, think about my belly. I think, about, think about. I do think bellies? about. I think about my dick. Yeah, my dick. The only thing that my, would. My, 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 I've been working out a lot. Been eating real good. My belly's shrinking. Okay. Been seeing a lot more my dick lately. <laughs> okay. he, here's the rest of my sound effect. Here's the sound effect that, that's about to happen for my, that caps my life mm. and makes brings a big old smile to my face. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> that's me booting. Booting with the back of my heel, your fucking craniums, okay? The point is, is that when Michelangelo did the Sistine Chapel, please don't say Michelangelo. Okay, yeah, but he you didn't sound, you sound do like a, a, a like a like a, a white female news anchor uh, on the somewhere in Brea. Michelangelo. So we're here at Michelangelo yeah. High School. The, uh, Michelangelo. Uh, you don't speak Italian, Chris. Toscana, Tos Toscana, yeah. uh, <laughs> Roma. But uh, you don't speak Italian, so don't you do, do that. Don't you know what I mean? Don't you And uh, the fake fucking what, what Italian. Did, no, I didn't. No, he yeah. didn't. No, it's I didn't. Fake. What did you say? I speak Italian. I said, he was hey, speaking excuse Italian. me. Do you know where my wallet is? So, oh, um, fucking unbelievable. Uh, just to give you a taste. Means, yes. means wallet. Exactly. Don't you know what I mean? Don't you know what I mean? That's what. That's what I said. Do you, excuse me, but did you see my wallet? No, just that's just a that's just a line. But that's just a line. Why would you say that? It makes no sense. Because I'm making a larger point here, and the fact is that when Michelangelo did the Sistine he Chapel, well, he didn't time, do it. He didn't do it in front of people. People weren't clapping. People weren't laughing. People weren't entertaining themselves. They weren't having a good time. But when Will and I were on network television, yeah. It's not just fucking Don't tell me that Stop the drum. Stop it. When we were doing that, it was for millions of people. Hey, bro. Do not compare your performance on Conan with the Sistine Chapel. If you do that, I'm going to fucking come at him. I'm going to come at him right now. Just relax. No, I'm not. Are you comparing it? No. I think it's completely different because what we did was for a lot of people. What Michelangelo did was for one or two. So you're saying that what you did is just maybe, significant. Maybe what Michelangelo does is like taking a, right, taking a nap. No, 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 no leave no, him hey, alone. Please, hey, please, hey, 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 ow, hey, ow, 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 hey, ow, please, ow, 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 hey, he's fucking me. Ow, he's, he's trying fucking to me. fuck him. All right, oh, calm down. Oh, Jeez. So oh, Chris oh. was on, he was on Conan and it, it, it aired, it aired last night. My and, butthole. Uh, you can, uh, what? You can, by the time this airs, it aired last night. My butthole. Why'd you say my butthole? Why are you saying that? 
you, you touched my butt. I did not touch Thanks for listening butt. to the 10 Minute Podcast. Thanks for subscribing and downloading on iTunes. We're on uh, Stitcher Smart Radio. We're on Twitter, 10 Minute Pod, Facebook slash 10 Minute Pod. Hit the uh, Children's Research uh, Hospital banner, St. Jude's, and help out with the kids. And go to our website and do things. Chris, you ate a shit on stage in New Orleans when you I'm did, sorry, you what? Taped, taped what? his one hour. It yeah, he did his one hour special. I got special. two standing ovations for both tapings. It still sucked. I, it's a piece I'm, of shit. Okay, well. Shat the fucking stage, man. That's not you're true. The, you're the reason our culture sucks. Hey, the song is fucking going. I don't care. And you don't so bad. Shut up, man. It's bad. Why, I can't be honest? Would you shut the fuck up while the song you just shut up? Don't tell me to fucking shut up. I'll say what the fuck I want. I want want my hour back. What? I went to your dumb fucking taping for his Comedy Central thing and it's... Sucked. Okay, man, listen. And that sucked with hey, five S's. All right, would you just chill? Okay, look. Hey, welcome sucked. to the te- welcome Give to the ten minute podcast. Yeah. You want to buy something on Amazon? Ten, go to ten minute podcast okay. Yeah, don't and buy. Least, don't when it, when Chris's one hour comes out. Don't buy that on. Amazon. And there's all sorts of things. Hit the things. My name Game is Will, Fly. Game Fly. All right. Yeah. My name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian. The, I want my fucking money back and my time back for that one hour. The kid, Callan. All right, I'm Chris Delia. Now, look, I, I think that you're just kind of being fucking yeah. shitty because you flew all the way to New Orleans yeah. to watch him do his one. Yeah, yeah exactly. Thank okay. you. Can I get that? Can I get that airfare back? All right, look, man, you did other stuff in New Orleans too, and you were having a good time. All right, you were at the festival. There was that fucking jazz festival or whatever. All right, look, man, dude, I I think maybe you're coming at this from a different fucking. uh, I don't think that you it sucked, okay? Because I I got a characters. All right, I also make certain points. Laughing, yeah, that's a special thing, and it's like so fucking. I'm like, what are you people doing? What are you doing? What do you mean, man? What they are you doing? Get closer kept, to the mic. They kept laughing and 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 clapping. Okay. They're enjoying we themselves. We love you. And I was like, what the fuck? Are they, what are these people doing? He's doing. He's 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 pretending to be drunk, and then he's he's pretending to it's be. It's one of his fucking, bits. Oh, yeah, God. Okay. All these characters. The okay. Not, okay. Sounds okay like an some inter- some of my like bits. An, yeah. Sounds like an entertaining show to me. Some of my bits have characters in them. Some yeah. of them don't, and yeah. you know, it's like I know. Okay. I know. So what's your what's point? The Thank you for making me laugh. Wait, how about wait, what? how about fucking how about this? I go to his one hour special. I don't learn a fucking thing about life. <laughs> well, I don't know if that's you know, necessarily what learn comedy a fucking thing about anything. Let's cut, let's cut the it's brass tacks. It's just all hilarity. Yeah, it's yeah, all everybody's uh, laughing. I want to like, ask you two questions. Number one, yeah. what would you prefer to see I out of Chris's prefer, one hour special? Right. I would prefer yeah. that he would. Provide for me yeah. an insight right. that would teach me something about the following: yeah, no. politics, no. What? philosophy, that's, yeah. <laughs> raising that's, children. That, that, he doesn't have children. Marriage. I have zero children. He's not married. Medicine. Yeah. Uh, he, he's not, not a doctor. doctor. No. History. Also, not, not, not funny. History is not funny. And, history is the least funny and thing. And <laughs> finally. All of the above. Okay, okay well, right, you're you being very smug. You're you being very glib. Okay. You're being very smug. You know what? And my second question yeah. is this. Yeah. Um, I forgot my second question. Okay, here's Doesn't the problem. Doesn't really matter because I think that. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I didn't. I I don't appreciate sitting for one hour yeah. and watching well, not... a hairless chimpanzee. Ch- please call jump... it chimpanzee. Yeah, please. Well, the scientific way to say yeah. it is chimpanzee. Oh, and, you know, okay. I remembered my second question. What, you what fucking you. Cored a hole in my head and fucked it yeah. with what you just he said. Did. So obviously, I forgot yeah, obviously. what I was going to say because of all the words that came out of your fucking right. mouth. And that's obvious. But here is the second thing I was going to say: Was he funny? Did people enjoy it? Did people enjoy it? Yes. Okay. I mean, so he's very funny. Okay. I mean, so I'll, what? So I'll now, give what him. You, I'll give him. So now I'd like to one compliment. I'd like to, I'd and, okay, but, and, I will give him one compliment. I, 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 that. Technically, and if how? you if you judge being funny by people laughing really hard and in keep in room. mind we're judging a comedian doing a one hour special yes. of comedy so if we're just going that, to if we're just going to correct if we're just going to look at funny as the following criteria where people in a room are laughing a lot <laughs> Sounds and good. clapping and screaming yes then in that context he was <laughs> the funny. only context yeah. he was yeah. funny right okay, okay good so then now let me okay. allow, but, yeah. but, allow me attach an addendum to the two questions okay mm-hmm. here's the addendum yeah. what the fuck is your actual problem right my that's problem the <laughs> my problem is that that's all it is funny as shit oh. you know <laughs> for an hour and, and, okay. and call me a nut call me crazy I'd like a little more from my comedy <laughs> right 
Do you what? hear what you're saying? You're what? coming off really shitty to that's your friend. A, but it's I, also and like I hate saying, doing it. I hate coming off shitty, but I'm trying to help him. That's like saying, trying okay. Trying to help him get so, some... So that's like saying, look, the, sorry, yo, yeah. I, go, I, you know, I, I have a medical problem. I got to go in. I got to get surgery. Yeah. And then the doctor takes out the medical problem. And then you're like, okay, all he did was fix my health. Okay. I'd like a little more. Right. Yes, you would. And, and that's a good example. No, you wouldn't. How I'd like that? to learn <laughs> a little something about life. No. Since I almost died and he had to take out my liver. Here's... Or whatever it is, no, and not. get a transplant. That's not I his responsibility, him, though. I don't want him just to fix me. Now I'm well, walking yes, around you do. all healthy. No, actually, well, yes, yes that, you do. That's exactly why that's you do you that. My, uh, I'm having kidney failure. There's a kidney yeah. donor. I have a new fucking kidney. I walk out the fucking door instead of dying. Now here's the fucking thing. You take away what you want. And that's he, it? That's, that's right. It? Oh, and he I, gives you the service. Now you go off and, and learn about an, life. He, okay, so there's no obligation on the doctor to teach me a little something about life and why I'm lucky to be walking around. No. Okay. That's not his responsibility. So, so, so Chris, Especially with yeah. Western medicine, okay. you are a yeah. symptom. You're a okay. walking symptom. Right. So they Chris's only symptom. responsibility is yeah. to get up on stage in New Orleans. Don't do that face. <laughs> make everybody Look laugh at his face. really hard. Get five, I don't think it was eight ovations, which was yeah. obnoxious. Yeah, 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 yeah. So fucking obnoxious. Yeah. These He's, idiots are just fucking clapping away. So all I, all I, all I have to okay. do as a comic is make people laugh. Okay, he's making such a shitty like, face and, and well, please yeah, go to our Twitter. Face. Please go to our Twitter at 10MinPod when you hear this episode <laughs> yeah, so you can see his face <laughs> that he's making. You, you look like a fucking asshole. It's a shitty I'm face not being that you're asshole. making. I'm, I'm completely, I'm completely... You're making a long... At a loss. Yeah, you're making a shitty face, and people can probably kind of hear the face you're making as yeah. well, too. You're, you're well, making a fucking... Well, you're it's making, hard not you to look have like a this fish. face when I'm disgusted and disappointed <laughs> okay. in the fact that all you do is get up on stage, you're the rock star, everybody loves okay, Chris because of his long... Yeah, yeah. you know what I think? Yeah, I think I got an idea right, now what's going you know, on. You know, your hair, you wouldn't be fucking funny. Okay, but hey, we'll, we'll, hey. we'll, all right, that's a little bit. Will, why don't you say it? Because if I say it, it's going to be obviously kind of shitty. So you, you go for it. You're jealous yeah. as fuck. Yeah, you're jealous as fuck is what it is. You're, you're jealous as fuck okay. is what it, I think it might okay. be. Okay, not. And, you're, I, and here's how we spell that. I don't get jealous, jealous. the standard yeah, way. Right. And then S Z apostrophe <laughs> fuck. Jealous as <laughs> fuck. I okay. can't wait to see people's tweets with that. Okay, look, I'm being. Maybe I got a little energetic in my criticism. Okay. Yeah. You went off. Well, I mean, All right? You did go off, yeah. Now, there was some merit to what you did. Mm. You're, okay. a be- you're in some ways a beginner. Uh, no. I mean, no, no that's, that's not true. Not you're, not a, you can't you're, say that. If, can't if say you that were anymore. a dog, you're, you're a six-month-old. You're a <laughs> you know, jumping well, around. Well, then for... If, <laughs> you know, if, if you, you know how they if have you're no right control. About, right. If you're friendly right, to everybody. <laughs> if you're right about that and you're not, then, I mean, he's probably got a bright future. So if you were a pet... Yeah, that's true, actually. If you were a pet, and you should be... I would use you <laughs> as only for petting. You wouldn't guard my house. I don't Can even I tell you. You wouldn't do anything. Right. You wouldn't me, pull a sled. You'd be you a pet, pet Let me tell unit. You this happened the other weekend, right? Chris yeah. had a special in New Orleans. Brian went out there, visited him, did yeah. the whole thing. I, I went up to Canada. I checked in on the folks. I had a yeah. nice time with nature. I sat by the ocean. I yeah. hiked and walked. Yeah. Right, right. Because for me, stand-up really doesn't stimulate me at all because I'm a film and television oh, actor Christ. and a writer. You now what, you're being shitty. Now you're and being I, shitty. Well, no, I'm just saying that, Chris, th- please take it like with okay. a grain of salt because sure. at least he was there. Like yeah. I was... I was not even not even in New Orleans. I was in another country. Well, that's because your parents sure. are I mean, foreigners. Canada's, they shouldn't even be in but Canada. Canada's my, doesn't my, really my count. I mean, you're Italian acting immigrants. like it was Australia, but it's not. So it's, it's not another country. Right really, it is, but it's not. But it's yeah, not, but it yeah. is, but it's I'm not. I'm saying so. I was up there enjoying nature, so it's like this. Yeah. This conversation kind of confuses but, me. And then don't do this. Like I'm, he's I'm, like jostling back and forth. I don't like that. No, don't do that with your hands. I'm acting like unfrozen caveman lawyer Phil Hartman. God rest his soul. I'm moving back and forth. Yeah, yeah, I guess in a Shatner-esque way because I don't understand this comedy and I can't look at you because it makes my blood boil he's looking down your blood is boiling yeah so I don't Okay. Agree with Brian. Here, here, I think I think just, you guys are two of the funniest people I've ever met. And likewise, maybe the two, I think you are. As maybe well. the two yeah. funniest. Well, I mean, let me just say one thing. The to two Chris. funniest guys I know. Let me just say one thing to Chris. What? Just tighten it up. Oh, okay. Hey, now man. that's actually what made me the most mad. And you know what? You fucking timed it so the music starts up so he doesn't have a whole lot of time to get yeah, back. Yeah, that's bullshit. Like, tighten it up. Just need that's to tighten bullshit. It up. So you win. Well, yeah, win. No, he doesn't win you, because I tell you what. It's not about just getting up and making everybody laugh really yes, hard, it is. Chris. No, it's for an hour. I don't do that. I, I do do that, and that is what you're supposed to do. And I got like how many applause breaks? I mean, yeah, because you're and a they all floppy, stood up afterwards. Floppy fucking. I make good fish. points. 
your dolphin out of water? No. You know, obviously, if you throw a dolphin with a bunch of hair on it and it's flopping around on stage, people are going to laugh. Oh, they've okay? got some beautiful, That's, beautiful whales it up does, in Vancouver. It doesn't matter. Oh, God. Is it jealous? It's jealous. No. It's fuck. Stop saying that. You're jealous? It's fuck. Stop saying that. Thanks for listening to the 10 Minute Podcast. Thanks for downloading subscribing on iTunes. Please tell your friends about the show. We're on Twitter at 10 Minute Pod, Facebook slash 10 Minute Pod. All three Brian of us. BrianCallen.com. Go to that. Yeah. And, My and special stand-up. comes out and in the fine. fall. Oh, Follow us on Comedy man. Central. You ready to make it happen? Yeah, yeah I guess so. Happen, man. Uh, sure, man. Let's make it too fucking hot. Punch somebody in the face. What do you mean it's too hot? It's too hot nowadays. No. 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 Some podcasts are slow. Yeah. And you don't know how long they last. There it is. Stop That's it. why you're listening to 10 Minute Podcast. The song. Yes. No, the song no. doesn't need any help. And I, hey, here's the deal, dude. In LA, we're having a fucking heat wave, and it's terrible. First oh. of all, the air conditioning broke in my fucking house, okay? I have two broken air conditioners. Oh, okay. what's up with your fucking house? And okay. First of all, only have one air conditioner. No, because have... I have two floors, okay? I'm so yeah. irritable, man. You're, got, you've been irritable got, since you got here. I got three floors. Then you got more than one air conditioning. You no, have you to. got central air and heat. No, you got you got two different ones that do it, and they do do different ones simultaneously. You get two different temperatures, whatever, which one you like. <laughs> Just because you talk longer doesn't mean them. He's got the wind window ones that you see in the No, in I don't the have the window city. ones, okay, because I have a large house. But let me tell you something, man. LA doesn't know what to do with the fucking heat, dude. The second the heat, I went to, I did two shows. I was at the Laugh Factory and then I was at the Comedy Store, okay? When I showed up, when I showed up at each of the places, it was the Amazon. It was way too fucking hot at both places. I walked in, it was hotter than what it was outside, okay? And what they both explained to me was, oh, sorry, we put the air conditioning on too late today. Hey, guys, it's been this hot before here. Put it on way earlier. Or, or absolutely have boa constrictors in your establishment. Because, because that's who lives where it's that hot. So when I show up right. and it's that hot, 100% hey. show me boa constrictors. Oh, he's so angry. Otherwise, I'm going to be super angry. He's knifing his hand at the table. He's not even looking at us. Welcome to the 10-Minute Podcast. My name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian the Kid Callen, And man. I'm Chris Too Hot D'Elia. And it gets, it gets really hot in L.A. sometimes. You know who sucks is the, the people who don't have air conditioning in their cars or... Uh, you know, they end up renting a place in in the winter, and they go, yeah. "Oh no, it's like yeah, open yeah, air, yeah. and it'll know, be but, fine." I know, and but, then one of them dies. But, but, the, but, the, but the heat, <laughs> the heat's not worth that. It's, it's not worth getting summer. that riled about. I when, mean, he's. No, people die. People die because of this And not even hot. old people. Old, no, old no, no, no. sick people die. No, 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 no. Two fucking idiots who, like, move out here from fucking they Michigan or something. They don't something drink go, enough water. Yeah, they don't drink enough water. They go like, hey, we're going to go to film and school. And then they or die. We're going we're gonna to make a documentary yeah. about our lives or something really smart. And then they get, like, a, a, an apartment together in Hancock Park. Yeah, yeah. And it's That's a, exactly a, where a they get. A brick. They're like, hey, if we pull our money, we can yeah. get half of this duplex. Right. And then one of them goes to sleep and doesn't they wake up in August. They go to, they're before the night before they go to 7-Eleven they get a Mountain Dew mm. and they get fucking sausage bites or whatever the fuck and, and then the they're sodium, like oh, the and sodium, the sodium and they just eat. they blow up overnight and they don't wake up what are what are the what are these guys names one of them is has to be Dale and the other one's name is Hamilton because he changed it from I, Harry I, I think I think one of them's name is for sure Rick just because you know Rick would do that Rick died yeah oh Rick died oh, did you guys hear that Rick died how of sodium and heat. <laughs> Where did he die? He died in this very room. Oh, a boa constrictor <laughs> ate him? No, 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 no. It just got really hot. See, because the landlord, he lives like way out in Whittier. Yeah. And he didn't change the air conditioner, <laughs> but he told us, you know, it, it gets the, it gets breezy. Already a boring story. No, yeah. but there's Even though no, someone died, you're already like, oh. No, but there's absolutely boa constrictors in here Chris. because of how hot it is. Hey, Chris. <laughs> What? How many times did you say boa constrictor yeah, last many, night? At the count and tweet us. How many boa constrictors would be suitable to keep your anger, your fury from... Like, if Okay, if, with how hot it was at the comedy store, yeah. I, I'm not fucking around. They would need at least three to four boa constrictors for me to, <laughs> be, be, you, to, me to be okay with how hot you, it was. Would you need uh, indigenous dyaks speaking in, in indigenous tongues running yeah, around? Yeah, you'd need actually... You'd need tropical birds just kind of hanging out, not flying because it's too hot. Right. They would just be f- hanging the fuck out. <laughs> and pygmies with blowguns? Yeah, yeah. No, it'd be too hot for them. They'd be outside yeah. like it's too hot in there. Yeah. That's your- hey, you know, uh, 
actually, I'm sort of curious about the, the heat in L.A. and how some people handle it. And uh, I I'm, do actually, well I'm actually curious heat. about how one person handles it in particular. Then now it's time for Keeping It Real with Shana. Here we, here we go. My name is Shana. I'm Keeping It Real on the 10-minute podcast with Brian Chris Real. Shit. Hey, y'all. Y'all, it's so hot up in L.A. right now. I can keep sandwiches warm under my titty like a George Foreman grill. Ha, ha, ha. You nasty. Shut up. This concludes Keeping It Real with Shana. Hey. You know, Shauna does this thing, and I don't like it. Like, it's, she says a fucking gross thing, and then yeah. she says, "You nasty." Right. Yeah. It's not us and being she tells nasty. Us to shut up. It's the like, only time, the only time, but I've she ever does been that on stage. She'll be, yeah, like, I know. I've seen her on stage. She'll yeah. go like, hey, blah blah blah, say something really gross, right. and then go, "Oh, shut up, shut up, shut up." And the audience <laughs> actually just kind of goes real quiet, right, right, right. And she digs herself a hole. Yeah, yeah. she's not very good. It's not. I, I've been called the only time I've been nasty. Is such a weird thing to say. I've been called nasty only when I'm cutting down the slopes on skis, or I'm dancing, or I'm throwing punches. Hey, you know, that's the only time that I've been, and usually I think it's a and that dude is nasty. You yeah. know, I get that a lot. Yeah. But other, otherwise, the way she uses it in that context, I don't. I get feel it. like I feel like you're kind of hijacking what she just said and turning it into something that makes you look good. Mm-mm. No, no, no. I don't. But, but don't you're use, saying I don't, know. don't use the word nasty to describe dancing it's, unless you're yeah. in Janet Jackson's uh, Janet Jackson's Jackson or Jackson. Hmm. Hmm. But you, see, now I can't no, finish no. my joke. I know because, because I said Jackson. Hey, you know what happened? Jackson. You know what happened? You got caught by the yeah. hmm police. That's what you got. <laughs> You got and and let me what tell you something. The, you the know, hmm police is really, really they're really prevalent. They're like, on the feet. Can I tell you what the Can I tell you what the when you get when the hmm police pulls you over, you what? know what, you know what's the first thing you hear? Yes. Hmm. <laughs> I did know that. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that for sure, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's, um, <laughs> And you know what I'm. You know what though. But, but let's stop. Let's just think about this for a second. We're doing all these bits. Guess what's happening during these bits? What? I'm sweating a lot. You sweat. Okay, and it's but still I too hot. The, I turn the AC on. But it doesn't here. matter because it's like you turn the AC on, and then it takes fucking six and a half hours to make no. the whole place cool. No, this and is a little, you never can hang no, meat in here. No, it's a little room. Yeah. So <laughs> meaning it should be fucking cold. Okay, for but sure. why do you I get would, so mad about I would the heat? I hang meat in here. Yeah. Because no. it just get a little sweaty and stinky, and, and that's what you, you want. You age it. That's how you age you, it. You want it aged. You is that right? Is that right? Get, well, yeah. you want the, the, the meat to start to brack down. Well, let me tell you something. The only meat that should be in here are live boa constrictors. Ah, back to the boa constrictors. Yeah. Hey, you know what's kind of fun when, when uh, it's hot? Mm. Fuck. Oh, no? Yeah. i tell you what, man. You know what? I, I got to tell you something yeah. for, for sure. I got to tell you something for sure. Uh, in all honesty, I know sweaty fucking is supposed to be like super dope and hot and I sexy, like but let me tell you something. <laughs> And, and and this is w- the God's honest truth. I like nice, clean, dry fucking. And nah, I'm serious. No, no, nah, no, no. no I because like I like tropical. to feel. No, I know. Nah, but I like, I like to feel. Fucking. I like to feel the nice, clean, dry nature nah. of a woman's skin. And the only thing that's okay. wet are downstairs in the private area. Now you're you're a Puritan. I like a. That's why I like Miami fucking. <laughs> Miami fucking is <laughs> no, my favorite I, thing. You know what I like? Mm. I like Virginia fucking in the fall. <laughs> yeah, Virginia that's re- that's more romantic fucking Miami I know, fucking. I know. Miami fucking is more like oh, uh, I like to get I like to get to Miami fucking while I'm doing some Alaska fucking and chicks are like, How the fuck are you sweating so cold? Interesting. Here? It's very interesting. I, and babe, it's cause I'm working so hard and you getting me so hot. Yeah. Yeah. Well but you gotta work hard I with do. that nub of yours. You no, no, work. I don't have I a nub. Get it. You're so no, 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 no. But we talked about this though. You guys more you do you, you know, you do hard fucking brain, I get it. But me, I'm strictly romance. Like I've never had sex, I've only made love. Oh, For real. Even on, with hookers, bro. even with hookers. And come on, bro. Being seer, but you know, hey. I just I, I like good, clean, dry fucking, not too much work going on, but serious mind work. But when you say being seer, do you mean you're being serious as in being S E R apostrophe, or are you being sincere as in being a- apostrophe S E? Is the rest of it works for sincere. both? Both, both, yeah, both. works for you know both. What's, you know what's the best thing when you're having sex with a girl and it's really hot and you're working real hard, yeah, right? and you're up there just minotaur. Unlike right? it, you know what I mean? Oh, come mm-hmm. on, minotaur. And, and, and there's a bead of sweat just yeah. running from my chest, de- reverse up my neck to my chin, Into her yeah. mouth. and she's like, eh, and either, she's behind either, you, and she's behind oh. you going, Arr. no, she's not fucking <laughs> me. Yeah, 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 and. <laughs> 
Uh, and, you, and yeah, you sweaty fucking bear. Yeah, you bald fucking bear. You sweaty. Let me be in control, you sweaty piece of uh, shit. Hey, that's not hot, and I would never let a chick fucking strap on and do me. That's I don't want to turn any fans on when I'm fucking. I want it to I be want, fall. I want, I want it to be dry, no. and the only thing that's wet is in my downstairs area. I want a bead of sweat to hit her either, yeah, in the mouth or in the eye or even funnier, up her nostril. Hey, bro. So and she then, goes like this. <coughs> yeah. And then, uh, well, just to break it up. Gross. It's like Shauna digs herself out of a joke hole. Right. I like to dig myself out of the fuck hole. Interesting. Yeah. You know, I, Swe- sex would be so much doper if it wasn't so uh, much. It was so exhausting. Do you know I'm, what I mean? Screw that. I'm no. in crazy shape, so I don't. I don't no, know I am in crazy about. shape as well. I, I'm, I am. But I what I like to, to do is just fucking not be exhausted. See, I don't know what I that like means. to pass out. I'm That's romantic nice. though. I, I have no idea. I like to lay a girl down on her side and just push inside, Ew, and then gross. just come and then go to sleep inside her. Hey, bro. Inside her? Yeah. yeah we both fall asleep, and then we wake out? up, and I'm still in her, and then we fuck again. That's how you get staph infection. Hey, li- thanks for listening to the show and telling your friends about it. Uh, come, come to my. Now we're all here. Now we can start. Yep. Let's do See how that goes. Because it was late. He was late. Minutes late. Well, we all know who he is. Don't live yep, in. We do. Don't live in. Um, you know. Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to Ten Minute Podcast. Hey, welcome to the Ten Minute Podcast. If you're gonna buy something on Amazon, something on Amazon. I'll go with that. If you're going to buy yeah. something on Amazon, go to 10minutepodcast.com, hit the Amazon banner. We will not. Have we'll we get... made any money? Yeah, we've made yeah, money. We you have. Seen... On you know Amazon? what, dude? Let these people buy. You know what, dude? What? Shut the fuck up. Hey, right you away. shut up. Okay. And you... Chris is your upset. Your shirt is go ahead, fire so away. ridiculous. Fire away. Go what? ahead. Do whatever you got to do. Your shirt's the worst shirt. I, I'm, I'm serious. Just tell me when you're done. It, look, it's bad camouflage right. with a pigeon. Okay. On the front. It's right. terrible. Why are you wearing that? My name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian the Kid Callan. I'm Chris D'Elia, and Dude, I got Go ahead. Take a picture and please tweet that retarded Go for shirt. it. Yeah, it's, it's fine. The worst Chris, shirt. Has been, Chris has been wearing, I think you Tell tweeted, you, you told some people earlier this year, the beginning of 2014, it's, you are only buying and wearing clothes that Cameron would wear. Right. It's rapper. made of vinyl, bro. That's infuriating. <laughs> that is infuriating. It's, and, but that's cool. And you know what? As dumb as shit as that is, Chris, it's not even the biggest problem we have here. No, today. and let me let me actually before you even chime in on that, yeah. it's a choice, <laughs> and it's something I'm sticking with. Okay. Now that being said, Chris, yeah. somebody, yeah, in this room, <laughs> decided to shake things up a little bit, yeah, and change something about our lives. Yeah. See, you know what? Yeah. Your sweater as. Looking weird as it is, yeah. it's like a flowy it's, it's like psychedelic a, camouflage oven, thing. It's like made of oven mitt, and there's a pigeon on it. Right. It's a definite choice, and it pisses me off. Right. Mangry. Sure. Mangry. Mm-hmm. And Mangry I, too. And I understand that yangry, and I respect that yangry. But you know, this year I'm yeah. dressing like Cameron, yeah. and that's how it's going to be. And yeah. I guess you gonna be angry. No, but you know what? That doesn't have to affect me. Right. I don't even need to deal with it. You know what? You're right. Right. When you leave here with your sweater, I go, nah, that's my buddy Chris, and he's got a sweater. Don't give a shit. Right. But Brian has done something that affects us all, as you've said. Yeah. Now, what he went and dumb as shit did, dumb. and I'm looking at it right now, and, it, oh, yeah. and it's on. infuriating the fuck out of me as I just am looking at it for the first time. Come on. It's- I told you. Okay. It's the- <laughs> we, all so- had, we all had a great a great thing go. You yeah. listen to our podcast. Yeah. You like our podcast because yeah. you're, you're fans of the podcast. You right. wait. Some of you wait. Oh, you know, it's Tuesday. It's Thursday. Yeah. We get yeah. the part. You get to listen to how we talk. You yeah. get to listen to what we do. Our right. bullshit. Our silly nonsense. Right. Guess what? We did that all day long right. to each other on text messaging. Yeah, via we had text. A group text going, yeah. and we would iMessage each other because yeah. we all had iPhones. We all have it, iPhones because it's guys, 2000 because it is 2014. Guys, right. And and the thing about that is, if you have an iPhone, you understand that the iMessages come in. They're blue. If you're at Wi-Fi, they come in free. They're not going against your SMS charges. Yeah. You know, some listeners won't know what I'm talking about, but please trust me that I'm infuriated because Brian went and got rid of his iPhone for no reason. I got bullied and for he's, zero. He's re- zero <laughs> reason. He guys. would replaced it with a pop tart. That <laughs> thing is the size of a pop tart. It's a Galaxy Three notebook. It's a piece. That it's thing. a hell of. Oh, can, it's a notebook. I can, I can well, swipe you text. Got a phone. Yeah, 
That I, thing looks like a piece of focaccia bread. Guys, that, it, that take, take, thing Yeah, take is, two of those and put some like seared eggplant no, and salami yeah, in there. It no. would be really tasty, actually. Yeah, it would be really, it's got really 12 good. You know what you could do? 12 phone, megapixels? You guys have you know eight. what you could do? Oh, 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 guess what? Anything over five, you golden. Because guess oh. what they were doing 10 years ago? Yeah. Five megapixels. No. And you know what they were taking pictures of? The Himalayas. No, no, They no. were taking pictures of the Grand Canyon. Yeah. You, you know, know what, pic- you know what you're taking the- pictures of? You dick. <laughs> and you know what you're doing after that? You're texting it in the group text. Yeah. And you can't fucking do that anymore because you don't have fucking iMessage. Brian has been complaining. It's, it's causing that a problem for me. Brian, Yeah, Brian has been complaining that we're not getting all of his messages. We're not. And you're not and, getting mine. You're right. not getting any of mine in I'm the group not. message. Yeah. And this is how I found out he got a different phone. Yeah. We were at the improv the other day, right. and he was like, uh, I got a pick I want to send you. I can't send it. And I said, what do you mean? Let me see. And yeah. he pulls out this fucking TV dinner tray. Right. Don't say that. Now, it's, we're going to take a picture of this. So of no, phone. Guys, if you follow us on Twitter. My phone died. I don't even have a charger for it. <laughs> you don't have a charger for that? No, I don't. <laughs> How much bad? How long have you had that? I'm in trouble. That thing well, is, what do you plug it into to fucking do it? It looks like a VHS tape. I, yeah, I don't know what to do right now. It's guys. so bad, and you know what, dude? Why? You got it for no reason. <laughs> that's well, the why. That really pisses that's us the off. Thing. Your phone, your other phone no. wasn't bad. It was fine. Wait, guys, the reason I got it for no reason was it has better <laughs> camera, and I thought I'd do some Instagram. But that's video. Oh my you, God! You're the. You are such a moron. You got a better <laughs> camera for Instagram. Guys, I wanted Insta- better. Instagram was made for the iPhone. And, and I, Brian, Instagram automatically turns your video into some version of Flash oh. that's easy to download for everybody. Therefore, in essence, it takes down the quality of your fucking video. If you shot it in HD, then you put it on Instagram, it's just going to come into the standard definition yeah. of the shows what up on, on each at? phone. On this phone. Guys, on this yeah. phone. Hey, hey, you, you know, Max, 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 you you know what I'm not going to do? Yeah. I'm not going to go on my TV yet because it's not 2027 and I'm not going to look up Instagram.television or whatever it's become in that year and watch your videos in full HD because you know what why Instagram yeah on the phone you're talking about a 2 inch by 2 inch fucking video you want to look at fucking 12 megapixels of some mega- bullshit mega- girl mega- in some hmm. dress or hmm. some bullshit fucking got, meal? But, but wait a minute. But, I got swipe. I got swipe. But wait swipe a second. But wait a second. Megapixel? So, I, I get it, man. So, but there's hmm. a bigger issue here. Okay, I want to read these I texts. I got swiped. Me, Brian, Chris, and Logan, our producer, were texting back and forth just yeah. yesterday about meeting today to record. My life is less fun. Okay, so... No, 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 no. Okay, so I'm saying something here about, oh, okay, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, two hours ago, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. For us hanging out. Okay, and then Brian out of nowhere... This is directed at one person, but there's four people in the thread. And he says, I can't. I only get yours. WTF with like five exclamation points. I go, can't can't what? Who's? Calm the frig down, brah. Wink. Your phone is fucked. And then Chris says, he got a new phone that isn't an iPhone, like a fucking moron. It's so big and stupid. The worst phone I've ever seen. And then I say, that's real dumb. Capital letters real. Brian, get your iPhone back, and I'm serious. Other phones are not as good. Then Chris says, makes me really mad. Like, what the fuck did he even need a new phone for? Everything was fine. His phone now sucks. And then uh, Logan says something about, oh, I can get you a copy of the points later. He's still on, on, you know, what we're talking about. I I can't get any of them. Yeah, right. We're talking about, you know, the uh, sponsor read or whatever. And then I say, won't need that until whenever. No, no, no. Thanks, Logan. The biggest problem right now is that Brian has volunteered as a beta tester for some new weird phone. <laughs> and then Logan says, Brian, if you didn't turn iMessage off before you switched from an iPhone, you're fucked. Is that right? That's what Logan said. And he's right because and he's I, Logan and he knows what he's talking about. I didn't turn off. They didn't tell me And to then it. he said he probably didn't, didn't see to. that, though. And then I say, and this is the last one I'll read. Oh, no, there's another one that's funny. Uh, I say, (laughs) well, if doing that involves doing anything at all, then he's definitely fucked because he clearly didn't do anything except for get a shitty new phone. And then Brian goes on. He's screaming here. It's a Galaxy 3. Then he calls us the C word. He says, you (laughs) guys have to turn on your SMS messaging. You you don't ever have to turn on SMS messaging. You don't have to do anything. You didn't turn off your iPhone. So here's what happens. Every time I go to text you regularly when it's just yeah. me on you because I got to also do shit for you and not just in the group, it, it, my phone goes to send it to an iMessage and then it, sa- and then it says, no, didn't work. Guys, Try I, as a text I, message. I need okay. out of my phone. So now I got to do it twice because no. you're fucking I, shit ass. I need out of my phone. I'm nervous now. Well, Get a fucking iPhone. Go back yeah. to the bullshit 
kiosk. Who did, who did that? You got that? Why did this happen? At, why did this happen? Glendale, I don't know. At the Glendale Gallery. I got talked into it. Oh, it by who? By the guys at Verizon said it's a better phone. Oh. They're, you know what they're doing? What? They're drug dealers. They have to push what they're told to push. Damn it. You know? I don't like this phone anymore, you guys. It's too big to text with my thumb, If too. you follow us on Twitter at 10MinPod or uh, Facebook slash 10MinPod, please go and check out a picture of Brian holding up his phone. And you might even... And you might even uh, see Chris's sweater in the background. It's a terrible sweater, man. <laughs> Doesn't matter. No, Doesn't but matter. That thing it's is like a if, sweater. It's like, what are it's you like wearing? If Justin, it's like if, if Justin Timberlake uh, fucked a guy and that was news and then <laughs> and then somebody shot Obama. Nobody gives a fuck about Justin Timberlake fucking the guy because somebody shot Obama. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking shot Obama with that bullshit. No, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look, that. don't call me that. I made a technical error. Okay. I'm, g- we, I'm old. All right. Can we please? No, Damn Brian, it. you're not old. You're very young. Shot. You fucking shot Obama with that bullshit <laughs> Jeez, notebook. Dude. Hey, call a phone a phone. Not another thing. It's not a notebook. It's a phone. Hey, you know what it is? It's a cupcake. You look, bought a fucking look, cupcake. I have a pen. Is that something else? It's a, a pen. It's called a, 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 call a stylus, you old fuck. It's a stylus. I, I idiot. And you don't want an idiot. I have a fountain pen in it. We are talking, and you are listening, because it's podcast nope. time with the pals. Don't say that. Yes, it's no. the pal time with the buddies and say pals. Say it differently. Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to 10-Minute Podcast. Hey, welcome to 10-Minute Podcast. Uh, if you're going to buy something on Amazon, of course, go to 10minutepodcast.com. Hit the Amazon banner. You'll be helping us. Uh, you get all your stuff for the same price. You know what I also want to say? I want to say, if you like the show, and we know you do because you're listening, and we appreciate you, go to iTunes and give us a review. Rate and review us. And uh, that's a good thing we'd to do for podcasts. We appreciate it. We appreciate it. My name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian the Kid Kellen. And I'm Chris D'Elia. And every time you say you're the kid, it makes me more and more angry. Why? Well, People so know me as the kid because I'm, I'm ageless. However, I do have to tell you guys something that's on my mind. Yeah. What's that? I put, a, get, I put together a list mm. of my favorite things to put on your feet. Number one, sneakers. Oh. Dress shoes, penny loafers, uh, boots. Yeah. Fuck, uh, flip-flops. Yeah. Moccasins. These are all good things. Oh, so yeah. far they're great. Moccasins. Yeah. yeah. Heels, if you're a woman. Yep. Socks. Yep. Socks. All right. You know, what, you, know what I like? you know what I love on the top of my foot? Hmm. On the top of my foot. Hmm. Your fucking cheek. <laughs> you know that? Your fucking cheek. You know what yeah. I like just under my two front toes? Yeah. The two yeah. front toes, my big toe and the other one? Yeah. With a hard part that's attached to the rest of my, my, my fucking... Huh. My leg. I like... The front of your fucking teeth. Yeah. Hey, Chris. Hey, Chris. You know what I like just underneath my heel? What's that? Your temple. Uh-huh. Guys, <laughs> right? uh-huh. Am I doing it right, Brian? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good. You're not you're doing good. it right. Yeah. Because you know what would happen if you put your heel on, on my temple? What's that? You'd go to sleep for a while. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe but forever. I shit your right, pants. Right before that. <laughs> right before that? What? Yeah. You'd say, boo ba and yeah. that would be it. You'd, you'd go say, like this. You'd say, eh, you'd say, eh, eh, say, you'd say, what would I be saying? You'd what say, what would I be on my way to saying? Good night, everybody. Nope. <laughs> I would be you'd on see, my way to saying. You, and you'd say, good nah. night, everybody. Good night. Nah. I would be on Sweet my way to you. say, but Will, what's on your feet? Oh, I think I know what this is about. You're upset at the shoes I bought. Oh, uh, hold on. Well, no, I'm not because mm. you didn't buy shoes. Yes, I did. No. Yeah. I bought it. I buy it, Chris. You know what? I don't know the fucking names of them. I think they're called... I don't even know what they're called, actually. Barefoot shoes? Because you know why you didn't? Why? Because you know what doesn't have names? What? Nothing. <laughs> so... Did he buy himself some of those vibrant five-toe? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Those rock climbing yeah. kung fu ninja oh, yeah. slippers. I, and I, you know what? This will really anger you? Yeah. Went hiking in them. Oh, That's boy. also nothing. No, it's great because it focuses, it makes you uh, walk on the palms of your feet. Chris doesn't it's, go outside, it's, though. It's, nah. it's Chris doesn't go outside. No, I know Chris is going to get upset that I bought a pair of shoes for hiking that are very weird. You know, you know what else I did? Go it's not shoe. You know what else I did them? It's not shoe. You know what I did them? What? Uh, I went, and I, this is probably what's setting Chris off. What is it? I showed him a picture. What is it? Remember the picture I showed you? Yeah. I went for a bike ride 
around Venice and Santa Monica on the Strand mm-hmm. on the beach. In those? And, and I was wearing those. So and I was danger. on a bike. And danger. And I, I also I, went I to have Abbott, a problem I went to Abbott Kinney and I bought a and I bought a coffee. So that means I was sitting in a coffee shop, that one yeah. over by Jelena. Yeah. And in, in those so in my vibe. Do, do you know what those do? And anger. Can I tell you guys what And they, anger. No, no, because you're gonna make it serious. No, and right no, I'm now not. I seriously want to say absolutely do not wear those. Do you know what they do? Do you know what those things actually do? And it's been clinically proven. They dry, they dry up all the pussy That's within a, a, like literally a, a 300 yard radius. It's like, you know, they when the, dry like the desert. You know, when the Hulk does the Hulk smash and yeah, yeah. anything near him in a certain yeah. radius is fucked. Yeah. Yeah. That's what those shoes do they to come. <laughs> hey man, don't use that they word. Desert. Oh, it's the Brian, desert. Brian, don't make a sucking noise. Yeah. <laughs> Suck hey, the moisture. That's out. what they do. They suck do you the have moisture. A, do you have a girlfriend that gets too wet during sex? <laughs> then buy these idiotic five toes. So you shoes. would know what it's like be to fuck sure, dust. Absolutely. <laughs> be sure to fuck way drier. Right. <laughs> hey, you're, why is your cunt so dusty? Stop saying it's that. It's dusty because we'll walk by in those. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's little... You get your, Did you get your car in Tempe in <laughs> <right>. July? <laughs> Here's what we're gonna do. If you uh, follow us on Twitter or on Facebook uh, with the Ten Min Pod, there, uh, I'm going to. We're gonna tweet the the a picture of my shoes. Yeah. Uh, and then the picture after... that I showed Chris before we recorded that made him so very angry. Yep. Yeah. Did they come with a ninja mask? No. No. And then uh, I went they... hiking. Then Chris, I went to Topanga and I hiked no. with my buddy Johan. And oh. angry. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. And angry. Me and Johan. Here's you know, the deal. You know big, Yo. handsome Here's the big handsome blonde. Big handsome Johan. I love him. Yeah. It, yeah. That? We did. You know yep. he's way is better why looking you, than you, Chris. Okay, is that why you hang out with him? So he can balance out the dry pussy that is happening because of your fucking stupid shoes? <laughs> no. So when he comes around, he And you know what? You know who wet? else came with us? You know who else came with us? Our buddy Miklosh. Absolutely not! <laughs> we went hiking. No. We went on the bare bone, the bareback trail. The Miklosh the, the, sounds like a like a, like a mineral in the same, in the in the Shilajit family. You oh, are. Oh, hey, if, and speaking of Shilajit, you guys want some if you want to buy some Shilajit, go to 10minutepodcast.com, hit the Shilajit banner, and you will be purchasing that from my other buddy, Johan. You and, are not. And his brother, you Cyrus. Are not the, do these two of things? my best pals. No. Johan and Cyrus. You're they are doing, the Walter don't White buy and Jesse. Listen to me. Pinkman You're doing things what? that are not things, <laughs> and you're wearing things on your feet that are not something. But Chris, a little while and back, you're doing it with people that don't exist. No, my, the, both those Johans and Cyrus and Miklos exist. Here's one and thing. Let me tell you the only dude. thing I know are you more, in the movie Die the Hard? The only thing I know more than the fact that you don't know a guy named Johan yeah. is that you don't know. Two guys named Johan. I do. I'm not going to give their last names. Johan, Johan, and Miklos. And Cyrus. And Cyrus. And Cyrus. You guys want to break into that tower and And fuck up Bruce Willis? And you know what? (laughs) It's 1985. Miklos, uh, Cyrus, Cyrus, and the Johans. Johan, Johan. And Will. Yeah. They all and have William. ponytails no. except for Will. <laughs> no, they don't. None of them have ponytails. And we did some That's... hiking, and I was wearing my Vibrams. And before that, I went to Venice, and I bought some some uh, coffee. And absolutely no girls talked to me because I was wearing Vibrams oh, and riding around on my bike. Not. Oh, and by the way, the picture that I'm going to send was only to piss off Chris. So now you can enjoy that picture. No. And my bike is in the picture. No, you're going to. And gonna my be... bike is a hybrid bike. No. It's a nerd bike. That's it's 18 a speed. Noise. Gas yep. and power. Even the no. Coffee dried up. No. Stop making that sound. He's gonna. He's gonna. You, Look, you, I stand by weird shoes. Chris, no. you're a guy that says that no you one stand should go to Coachella. In weird shoes, you which is the problem. You don't want anyone to go to Coachella, and you don't want now. You don't want anyone to wear weird shoes, go hiking or biking or drink coffee or hang out with Johan, Johan, Miklos, and Cyrus. Because he's just like. Oh, Listen, you <laughs> hang out with super sexy dudes with exotic names because you have shoes that dry up pussy. And you need well, the pussy you know to it's, get wet somehow. It's Stalin and the pussy dryer. Stalin <laughs> and the pussy dryer. Well, then maybe it's a challenge. Maybe, oh, shit, you should see some of the shoes that Yo has. There's some p- pretty Whoa! fucking weird shoes. 100%! Yo! Don't call him Yo! That's his name! 
That's what he's you my buddy. You call him Yo. Uh, you know what? Johan's never heard the do podcast. You go, do you go? Do you go? Hey, Yo Yo. When they're together, Hey no, Yo Yo. I don't. They, I think y- both the Johans have only ever been in the same room once. I think you guys were here. It was at a party at yeah. the house when yeah. they were spraying and by the guns. same room. He means his head because that's where he made them up. <laughs> How about this? Johan has a pair of uh, shoes that are also no cushion, but they don't have toes on them. What do you think of that? Well, and anger. He should die. Here's the deal. Look, I don't know why you guys are so pissed off. Now we've done an Johan entire podcast. Johan never heard the podcast I heard you say. You know yeah. why? Because he is not, he, he definitely isn't technologically you know, savvy. You know, is my right? good, my you know, good buddies. Uh, no, no, he's, he's down. You should, you should hear Yo's SoundCloud. Oh, nope. There's a lot of good uh, house and trance and world do, beat. Do you, out know, here. do you know what you're doing out with the story? Here. You're ta- turning me into Stalin. <laughs> you're becoming I like kill, Chris. I want to kill all those people, <laughs> including you. Well, you know, Sai, my good buddy Sai no. and Yo, not no. to be confused with Yo, just no. Sai and Yo, no. they're two of my best friends, I've known uh-huh. them forever. They listen to the podcast and they're selling the She Legit. So you check them out. Hey guys, don't what's up? Buy what's up, Sai? What's up, Yo? Hey, and, uh, She Legit has too many syllables it. in it. They should take those middle syllables out of it and call it shit. That's right. <laughs> Thanks for listening to the 10 it's minute podcast. Shit. Go buy shit.